In this video, we will be learning how to find the area of an equilateral triangle. First, the formula for area equals base times height divided by 2. In our equilateral triangle, we will have each side being 12 units long. Also, each angle in or the sum of all the angles in a triangle must equal 180 degrees. And since we are working with an equilateral triangle, then we take 180 divided by 3 because everything is congruent in an equilateral triangle. And so each angle would be 60 degrees. So we know our base is 12 units long. And the only variable we need to find is height. So in order to find height, you need to draw a straight line from the vertex going straight down to the base of the triangle. This creates two new triangles. This angle stays 60 degrees. This angle, since the straight line equals 180 degrees, half of 180 is 90 degrees. And since this 60 degree angle was cut in half, it is now becomes a 30 degree angle. In geometry, there's a rule of thumb about 30, 60, 90 triangles named after the angles, like the triangle that we just created. Opposite the side, opposite of the 30 degree angle, the side is x. Opposite 60 is x squared of 3 and opposite 90 is 2x. So in our triangle, with our side being 12, we have our 90 degree angle. Across from our 90 degree angle is 2x, which is 12. Across from our 30 degree angle is x. 12 divided by 2 is 6. And across from the 60 degree angle is x squared of 3, or 6 squared of 3. Now you, find your, now you find your height, which is 6 squared of 3. Now you just plug it into your equation to find the answer. So, and you need the whole base, so you'd go 12 times 6 squared of 3 divided by 2. 12 times 6 is 72 square roots of 3 divided by 2. 72 divided by 2 is 36 and then square roots of 3. 36 square roots of 3 is your total area for your triangle, your equilateral triangle with each side being 12 units long.